Uh, whether you're a teacher or a tradie, a mum or a musician, everyone feels stressed. Now, for some of us, it beca can become a serious health issue. Today, we are getting some advice on how to alleviate stress from Dr. Teresa Dobson. Teresa, welcome along. Thank you. Now, tell me, what is stress and what are some of the signs that we're suffering from it? Well, that's a really great question. Now, uh, simply put, stress is your body's inability to adapt to the current situation. So let's say you're in a traffic jam and you're getting quite frustrated or your kids are driving you crazy. These or, are common things. <laughs> these are common things. Or you're not getting along with your coworkers, right? We can all relate to that. What happens is when these issues happen and these problems occur in your body, stress hormones are released and it creates havoc, absolute havoc inside your body. So this is why stress has become the kingpin of disease. So what are some specific things that so, show that you're under stress? Yeah, so let's talk about a couple of things. So a couple of questions I can ask is, are you sleeping well? Are you having disrupted sleep? Are you having digestive problems? Are you overwhelmed? Do you feel anxious and frustrated at times? Are you worrying over money or relationships? Now, if you're nodding your head to a few of these, this means that your body is bombarded with stress hormones. Now, is this a good thing? Absolutely not, mm. because those hormones absolutely shut down your body's ability to heal. Wow, so they change everything, don't they? The gut is very interesting too, isn't it? Because that digestion thing, people sometimes think, oh, I'm, just, I'm just having a bit of an upset tummy at the moment. Absolutely, and most of our immune system actually sits in our gut and people don't realize that. So when we're under stress, the immune system gets pretty much shut down. So it's very important. So what are the long-term effects of stress then? Well, there's quite a few, but um, all obvious ones are fatigue. Uh, we have degeneration, we have, um, we have sort of sleep disorders, we have stomach problems. Now everybody can relate to a lot of these. But the problem is those lead to major problems like heart disease, diabetes, etc. So. so we really need to get a handle on the stress that we're feeling now. Even though sometimes we may not think we're under stress because our tummy's a bit, or a bit tired of things. Yeah. We really are. So what can we do then to sort of, what are your top tips for managing that stress? So what I do with my patients is I give them a jump start program. So that's a really fun and easy one. So we'll start with that. So breathing techniques, very, very important okay. because as soon as you have calm breathing, your body and your nerve system realize there's no tiger in the room. So we're gonna go through just a real easy, simple one. Great. And that starts with, and we can do it together, it's a slow breath in for a count of four. Mm -hmm. We breathe in, we hold that breath, we exhale through our nose for a count of eight. And we have to repeat that for about six times. And what that does is that tells your nerve system everything's okay, we're breathing deeply, because when we're stressed we breathe quite shallow and sharp. Okay, so right? that's a great thing to do. Yeah, so we breathe slowly. Now it takes about four to six times before your body realizes that it's not under stress, and then you can relax and you kind of feel like you got the tiger by the tail now. Right, so breathing is good, and what, have, what about this product that you've Okay, in? so stress zone is mm -hmm. the second thing I recommend, and I've recommended to all my patients when I coach them on stress. Now, um, stress zone is a natural product, and it's a, it has the amazing ability to balance all your stress hormones and happens very quickly. Wow. So I've never seen such an effective product and I've never used such an effective product. So what's in, in it? Product. It's got adrenal um, nucleic acids and adrenals. So it's, it's, re it's really hard to explain what those are without going into a lot of detail, but they work. Okay, well, and that's very I, good to know. Yeah, they work and, and they're not contradictive to anything that you can take and you can take them on an as need basis, which is really nice. So you don't have to always have it and they work really quickly. I've gotten calls from my patients right. when they're at lunch and they call me and say, oh my God, it's changed my, it's changed my day, it's wow. changed my life. So you can take so. those as and when you need them. And obviously the third thing would be that you have to take a bit of exercise. As yes, well and yeah, nice yeah. that's always a balance. People don't usually like that one so much, Yeah. but that is a really important one. So the ones I recommend are really easy. They're peak exercises or high intensity training. You may have heard them. Mm -hmm. Now what you do is, is you actually do this exercise about three times a week. It only takes 15 minutes a day, which is wonderful. Now, now this great exercise burns fat for 24 hours and it lowers your stress hormones. Okay. So it's a really, really nice, easy way to do things. So you can Google this. It's all information is all over Google about it. Pick your favorite exercise that you can plug into it and you're way to go. Fabulous, that is sound advice. So those yeah. are things we need to do to manage our stress, particularly at this time of year. Yes. Uh, great advice, Teresa, thank you yeah. so much. And Stress Zone is sold exclusively at Health 2000 and the lucky people in our audience all get free samples today. <laughs>